hi everyone welcome back to my channel hope you're all having a lovely day so far um today's video is a video that i'm really sad to be making um this is something that has you know happened really really recently and i'm going to get straight to it it's regarding shane dawson being allegedly thrown out of a military party um for basically being gay for not being straight for being homosexual this is allegedly what's happened i'm sure more more is going to unfold and obviously i do understand there is always two sides to every story but if any of you follow shane on snapchat um and twitter you will have seen the events unfold kind of on you know right in front of us um he turned up with his boyfriend to a military party um you know like a party sort of celebrating the military and he was a he's saying he was on the guest list and so he turned up at this event and was basically he is saying in his snapchats that he was allegedly thrown out of this party they almost broke his leg for holding hand with his boyfriend I mean, if this is to be true, how sad, sad, sad is the world we are living in? Why are people so bothered if people are straight or gay or not? Love is love. And why does it even matter? Who bloody cares? I don't care and nobody else should care either. And if this allegedly is all true, I definitely stand with Shane on this. Um, I understand that um, there are two, like I said, there's always two sides to every story. But what Shane has said on his Snapchat is that he turned up to the event, was thrown out for being gay or you know bisexual whatever and like I said that doesn't really matter and he was holding hands with his boyfriend they didn't like it and they threw him out um on his snapchat you'll also see him raising his voice to the security guards he, he was sort of saying these are the security guards that this cards that did this to us and they're then saying he wasn't on the list when they have the right to throw anybody out who isn't on the list and actually of course you're allowed to remove people you're not allowed to throw people out but you are allowed to remove people from a situation i'm guessing in a non-aggressive manner and if he nearly had his leg broken it seems to me it's possibly been aggressive and um even if he wasn't holding hands with his partner what gives you the right what gives any security guard the right to remove somebody with such a force that they've possibly broken his leg how 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 sad now a lady called is it tommy loren i'd never heard of her before actually has sort of spoken out and said this isn't true um and that they caused a scene i'm yet to see the scene they caught have caused at the moment um i may unfold later on um and i have seen the picture of another gay couple having a, like kissing in front of her i think it was at this event but i didn't see any of that with shane dawson and at the moment it just this is all just so so sad we are in 2017 this sort of thing should not be happening and if this does turn out to be true i really do stand with shane on this um it is so so sad that in 2017 we are still having to deal with this alleged moronic behavior and that's what it is it's just so sad and if anything can come from this video let's all be nicer to each other let's all be more positive let people live their lives how they want to live them um and just enjoy life and all my if this is allegedly you know i keep saying allegedly because i don't want to get in trouble but if this is all true then all my love and support and hugs goes out to shane dawson right now and um, let's show him some support let's all stand with shane and yeah i just think this is such a sad thing to happen in this day and age it shouldn't happen and also like i said before even if you were holding hands with your partner at an event for the military so what for one but two even if he wasn't what gives anybody the right to remove somebody with such a force that um he's possibly broken his leg i know what he said on twitter and snapchat earlier was that he's now um letting this all sink in digesting it all i think he's possibly going to make a video about it once the dust has settled and that he is going to be you know speaking with police on the matter and if this all turns out to be true he definitely should he definitely shouldn't let this lie and i just find it all really really sad so if any of you have watched this video please go over to shane say Gemma sent you and just give him a lot of love love and hugs and support and let's just love everyone no matter what you know sexuality they have anyway um really hope you you know go forward to shane give him some love and i hope to see you in my next video <sighs> bye